Good morning guys. Today's video is going to be a grocery haul and what we eat in a day. So I just got back from our Walmart grocery pickup and I'm gonna go ahead and unbag everything and show you what I got for the week. Okay, so I just got everything out. Um, I've got Cal watching his TV show. We've also got construction on our deck. So there might be a lot of background noise and a little baby over here, but we'll get through it. I've got corn dogs for the boys. They actually love to eat these for dinner and it's super easy. I just put them in the air fryer. And then for David and I this weekend, we're gonna have these cauliflower, callip, callip, Oh my gosh, these Cali Power pizzas. And we had them last weekend, they're actually really good. And the crust is made out of cauliflower, so it's so much healthier than regular pizza. And I'm just really, really trying to avoid carbs as much as I can. Okay, so then I got some snack items. I ordered some pistachios. The only thing is when you order online, it's really hard to tell the size. And this is like an individual serving of pistachios, but oh well. I'm excited because they don't have shells on them and they're a really good snack. I also got these um, salt and vinegar almonds. I've never tried these before, but I've heard they're good. And I'm just trying to find some healthy snacks that don't have a bunch of bread in them basically. So I got these little nut packs too. And then I can take these on the go with me. So those will be great. I'm sure David will love these. And then I also got some chocolate ones. These are just dark chocolate covered almonds and they're in individual packages. So that'll be a good treat. And this is another like treat item. This is chocolate, dark chocolate covered raisins. So I feel like they might be somewhat healthy because it's a raisin and it's dark chocolate. It's not like I'm just eating M&Ms, right? So I got those, I got Luna bars. I like these, but honestly, Cal will eat most of these. He loves these bars. So I got a box of those. They also make them in the mini sizes, um, but they didn't have them at Walmart. But the mini ones are great because they're just like a lot easier for him to eat because they're smaller. And then I got apple juice for the boys. I got some spaghetti. This is the spaghetti that we've been having lately because it's a veggie spaghetti. It's just like not as many carbs and it's also got a lot of um, vegetables in it. So I really like this. It tastes the same. I did get these jumbo shells to make a stuffed shell recipe, but honestly, I think I'm going to go ahead and buy broccoli instead and just ditch these all together because I really don't need this like extra noodles in my life. So. I'm not even gonna use that probably this week. Okay, so then I got some Rotel, cream and mushroom soup. This stuff is mainly just for cooking, ground cloves, lime juice. I got Italian dressing and salami for lunch this week. I think I'm going to do like a Italian sub, but instead of bread, I'm gonna do it on lettuce. So we'll see if that works, but um, yeah, we're gonna try that out. Then I got chicken, a chuck roast. This is probably what I'll make in my what I eat in a day. I also got these blueberry muffins for the boys for breakfast. They're super quick and easy. Um, one thing is they're a little bit messy because they like crumble apart, but for the most part, they're a really good easy breakfast. I know they're not the healthiest, but they seem to like them. Um, and then this is their other breakfast for this week, these brown sugar cinnamon bagels, and then they have them with cream cheese. And then I did get some fruit, also mainly just for the boys, um, green apples, red grapes, and then I got them some raspberries. I also got them some bread. We're gonna do grilled cheese and salami sandwiches for lunches this week. I usually pick two breakfasts, two lunches, and two dinners for them and just kind of rotate through those things. I got two bags of lemons. We always have lemon in our water, David and I, every single morning, so we go through this really quickly. And then I got some tortillas. We're gonna make um, burritos with this meat, which will be really, really good. And typically, I like to buy the Mission Carb. I think it's like the low carb ones, but I couldn't find them in the burrito size, so I just got the regular ones, um, but they're really good. Bay leaves, cilantro, avocados, pico de gallo. This is all gonna be for the burritos. And then I got a Caesar salad kit. I love this big kit. I get the family size and it makes two, um, well actually four. So it lasts us two nights of really big Caesar salads on the side. And then this dressing is so, so good. If you like Caesar salad, you have to try this dressing. It is the Sam's Choice Creamy Garlic Parmesan dressing. And so I add like a little bit extra of that on top of the salad. Um, 
the cream cheese, and then this is like all the dairy stuff. So I've got ricotta half and half. I'm making um, for those stuffed shells, which I'm actually just gonna use broccoli. Um, it's basically a chicken parmesan mixture, so that's why I've got these. And then it also called for some different cheeses. So I've got mozzarella, Italian, and parmesan, which I can also use these on our Caesar salad. And then I got some provolone cheese to go with the salami and our milk, which I, we buy a lot of milk. So I get three of the Fairlife DHA Omega-3 milks for the boys, and they will go through all of these. And then I usually get one fat-free one for David and I, and then this ends up being like the the one that the boys will finish off after they've finished all three of these because we don't drink that much milk, but I do like to have a fat-free option for when we do have milk. So that is all of our groceries for this week. All right, so I'm gonna start out with breakfast for the boys today. Um, this is gonna be cruise breakfast. I know you want this right now, don't you? I know, okay. So he is having a bagel with cream cheese and some cut up raspberries and grapes. And I need to grab you a bib because you're already dressed. And then half of a vitamin. Let me go get him a bib. Okay, now he's a little bit happier that he's got some food on his plate. But he's also got his whole milk. I did not nurse him this morning. I am um, <clears throat> trying to wean my 13 month old. So he's gonna have whole milk and that's why he was a little bit fussy because he kind of needs to eat as soon as he wakes up. So this is his breakfast. And this is gonna be Cal's, he has the same bagel. It's a brown sugar and cinnamon bagel with cream cheese. Cal's not really into the raspberries, so I'm gonna pass on those. And then the vitamins that they both get are the Plexus Chewable. It's a probiotic and multivitamin in one. So Cal gets a full one and Crew gets half. And then I also give Cal, usually, <clears throat> depending on how he's feeling, this elderberry immune support. And I don't know if you can tell by my voice, but we are getting a little bit sick right now. So he's definitely gonna have one of these little gummy vitamins today too. Okay, so since Cal won't be with us um, today, I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I make him for school. And I just go ahead and make everything the day before and keep it in the fridge. That way I don't have to worry about it in the morning. But he's got some grapes cut up and he's got some apple slices. I did just put a little bit of lemon juice over them too because they're already starting to brown even though I just cut them up like five minutes ago. Um, and then he's got some mozzarella cheese sliced up and then some salami sliced up. So that will be his, his main lunch and then I'm also gonna throw in a lemon Luna bar in case he wants a little bit extra. All right, so I just got done working out and then I went ahead and just like got dressed and ready at the gym because I'm actually gonna be running some errands today. Cal gets out of school at 2.30 and it's already, well, it's only 10.30, but I just, it's not worth it for me to drive all the way home and like get dressed and stuff and come back out. So some days when I drop him off at school, I will just plan on staying out for the whole day and that's what I'm gonna do today because I need to run to Hobby Lobby and Target and a couple other things, just some little drop-offs and stuff. So, um, all I've eaten today is nothing. <laughs> I don't usually eat breakfast. I don't like to eat until after 10 o'clock. So I do have a lemon water that I'm gonna be sipping on. I had some earlier this morning and then I also had my BCAAs at the gym while I worked out. So I typically will do some sort of drink whether it's sometimes i do coffee in the morning but typically it's like bcaa's or pre-workout or my plexus like slim and active something along those lines um and then i don't eat until later but there's a new like healthy protein shake little restaurant that just opened i tried to go there last week but they were closed so i'm going to try it again today um it is october 1st and i'm going to try really really hard to be really good and conscious about what i'm eating because um i said this in another vlog but i am starting to wean breastfeeding and i noticed that i'm like gaining weight as i'm the less i'm feeding him the more weight i'm starting to gain so i'm thinking about incorporating protein shakes into my diet as a meal replacement for maybe lunch because i typically don't um I don't know, I typically don't need a lot for lunch, so I'm thinking about doing protein shakes. So I'm gonna try out this place. I also ordered some pumpkin spice um, lean from Plexus, which is a protein shake that I actually really love, but it's a pumpkin spice flavor that's new. So I'm gonna try that. Yeah, I definitely wanna try to do possibly protein shakes for lunch. I don't know, I don't know if I can do it. That seems like not enough 
like food so let me know if you guys do that um but i think it could be a way for me first of all it's gonna be fast and inexpensive um and also it's gonna be not a lot of junk in it so i'm hoping that i can try to do that maybe just for like the month of october and see of course i'm not gonna do it every single day i'm still gonna like go out to lunch and stuff but I might try to do protein shakes for lunch on just days like this so we're gonna go check out that place and then I'll need to figure out something for crew I may have to just do like fast food for him because I don't really know what I can get him at that place but we'll see we'll figure out what he's gonna eat too Okay, just got my protein shake. And it's not bad, like I'm definitely gonna drink it all, but you can kind of like taste the protein powder. It's some sort of, I'm gonna look it up. It's some sort of like MLM. Okay, so they use Herbalife in their shakes. So that's the protein that they use. Um, but I can definitely taste it. The flavor I got is cookies and coffee so it's a nice flavor i just i don't know they had so many flavors though so i'm definitely gonna come back and try it again and they're like seven dollars they're a little bit pricey but we'll see oh we'll see if it fills me up right, and then there's a mcdonald's right in front of me so i think i'm gonna drive through that and get crew a little happy meal um for him for lunch and then he can just eat it um, at Hobby Lobby like in the shopping cart and that'll give him something to do and keep him occupied while I can shop. All right, update. We're about to go into Hobby Lobby. Almost done with this. It's just not very good. I was just talking to my friend. She said she's had this one before and it wasn't good. So it, I'm gonna go back and try a different one another day and give it another shot. But I'm also still really hungry. So I don't know if this is gonna fill me up. I had like a couple of cruise French fries. I would have loved to get a large fry but I didn't. So I'm gonna try to finish this and hopefully it'll hold me over. We'll see. Okay, I've got his Happy Meal and I'm, we're about to go into Hobby Lobby and I'm feeling like major mom guilt, like bringing this in, in the box where everyone can see what he's eating. Why do I feel like that? I don't know. I mean, I guess I could have like packed in something, but I just, I don't, there's like nowhere like good and healthy for little kids to eat I feel like and I don't know I grew up eating McDonald's and I think it's delicious so I shouldn't feel bad but I do I feel like mom guilt and I was like trying to think of a different way to like bring it in without everyone noticing what he's about to be eating but nope I just I'll just bring in this box I, I did get him apples though he loves the apples and he's only gonna eat like probably a few fries and maybe two chicken nuggets that's pretty much what he eats if he gets a happy meal all right, so I have just finished my errands and I went to Target mainly just to get like a bunch of like household items and things, but I usually will get like snacks at Target because <laughs> Craig just threw his snack. Um, they have a lot of different snacks at Target than they do at like Walmart. So whenever I go to, especially this like bigger Target that we have, I will get snacks. So I just brought them up front. Um, I'm thinking Crew's gonna fall asleep on our way to go pick up Cal. So, and I have plenty of time. So I will probably do a little part two grocery haul and show you guys all the snacks I got. And then I also couldn't help it. I had to get a pumpkin cream cold brew from there because I'm literally addicted to these. I could have one every single day. I don't, but anytime that I'm by a Starbucks, I treat myself to one because they're not gonna last long and they're so good. But I don't feel hungry, um, so I don't know if that protein shake just like, I don't know, I don't have an appetite anymore. I'm probably <laughs> gonna be really hungry pretty soon, but I feel really great now and it is like almost two o'clock and I feel like full and satisfied. Okay, we're gonna do a part two of the, the grocery haul. Um, I'm trying to be quiet because like I said, crew just fell asleep. So I got a ton of snacks. That's pretty much all I got was just a bunch of snack stuff at Target, but I got the Simply Cheetos White Cheddar Puffs. It's a big bag of individual ones. I like to get the individual bags for the kids because it's just easier. I can throw them in the diaper bag and I can just hand it to them instead of like getting out like a bowl and stuff like that. So I buy those a lot. 
And then I just got a big bag of like the baked variety of chips. And I also have, I also had stuff down here so don't lose it. Um, I did get some of the baby snacks. I haven't bought the baby snacks in a long time but they are really nice when we're out and about. So I got the puffs for crew. I mean, Cal will eat these too, honestly. And then I also got the Gerber yogurt melts. And then I got a thing of goldfish, and I think they're like Halloween themed. Goldfish. Um, these are for myself. So these are the popcorn, is popcorn a carb? Do I sound like such a blonde? I don't even know, okay. Well, I got these for me, um, but they are popcorn mini cakes by Skinny Pop in Sharp Cheddar. I've never tried these, but I've tried like a version of these and they were really good. And like I said, I'm trying to, you know, be healthy. Um, so just wait because I got a lot of stuff that wasn't healthy too. I got these. These are so good if you've not tried them. You need to try them. They're so delicious, but they're, I get the dark chocolate ones. They also have milk chocolate. I feel like the dark chocolate is a little bit healthier, but they're just pretzel thins. And like, I feel like something like this, like I'll just eat like, sometimes I'll eat the whole bag, but if you just eat like a few, like three or four, it's like not a big deal, like after dinner or something. So I got those. And then I also have never tried these peanut butter cups by Justin's. So I got these, just a little bag of mini ones to see maybe like after dinner or something. Like sometimes I just want something sweet. Um, and then I did tell you guys about these are the lemon Luna bars in the mini size. So they're like smaller ones. So I like these for Cal because he really likes them. And then he can just have like small ones. Um, I got some broccoli to replace those jumbo noodles that we're having this week. And then I think that's it except for a giant box of Oh no, there's more. Giant box of fruit snacks. And then I saw these. These are, I've never seen these before. These are the veggie, like the veggie straws, but they're veggie chips and they look like in Pringles cans. And Cal likes Pringles a lot, so I feel like maybe I can trick him and give him these instead. And what's this? Oh, and then I got these little like Parmesan crisps. Um, I've had these before, they're really good by themselves, but they're gonna be really good on Caesar salad. All right guys, we just got home and I'm gonna go ahead and eat some real food now. So I'm gonna have a couple of these, I love these like little cheese slices. I get these at Sam's Club. Um, they come in like a big bag. So I'm gonna have two of these and then I'm also gonna have some of this really good like salami as a snack, lunch, I don't know, that's what I'm gonna eat right now. Okay, I'm also gonna try one of these. And that was really good, I need another one. All right, we are all stocked up on snacks. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's five o'clock and I'm asking a poll on Instagram to see what we should do for dinner. Um, it's between smothered beef chimichangas and the chicken parmesan over broccoli instead of in stuffed shells. So I'm gonna put that poll on Instagram. Make sure you guys follow me. Okay, so for dinner tonight, it's in the fridge. You see it? For the boys, they are having fish sticks, which they both really like, and then raspberries. Crew has been loving these. I don't know about Cal, we'll see. And then this is butternut squash, which I'm sure Cal won't eat, but hopefully he'll try it. Um, but this is the butternut squash that I use, and then I'm just putting the rest in the fridge for later. And then, so this is Cal's meal, and then this will be Cruz, because I don't give him a plate, because he throws everything on the floor, so that'll be his, his meal. All right, the dinner votes are in on my Instagram poll. And everybody voted for the chicken parmesan with broccoli, so I will link the original recipe from Pinterest down below. But it's gonna be quite different since I'm not using the jumbo pasta shells and I'm using broccoli. But I'm gonna make it work and I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. All right, so the recipe calls for cooked chicken, so I just put some raw chicken breasts in my air fryer. And I have some olive oil and then, sorry, crew is ready for bed. This is the Trader Joe's 21 seasoning salute. So I'm just gonna put this in here and turn it to 
chicken, and then I usually turn down, actually 20 minutes will probably be good. doing I have marinara on the bottom and then steamed broccoli and melted butter and then this is essentially the pasta shell filling so this is like the ricotta and the cheese and then the chicken and since I'm not stuffing pasta shells I'm just going to scoop this over the broccoli and then I'm gonna top it off with some Italian breadcrumbs and then I will let it bake for 20 minutes and then I'm gonna pop it back out and top it off with some mozzarella cheese Cause your love is exceptional Here's how it turned out. So it looks just like chicken parmesan, but there's broccoli instead of noodles. And then here's that amazing Caesar salad with those cheese crisps that I just bought today. And that's gonna wrap up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I eat in a day and what my toddler and baby eat. Also, they had a bunch of snacks that I forgot to mention when we got home from school for the day. They had um, string cheese, they had some chips, and then they had some fruit snacks. They had a bunch of different snacks. Um, and then I also ended up breastfeeding crew <clears throat> one time in the like the late afternoon after we got home and then of course before he went to sleep. So I did breastfeed him twice today as well. But that's pretty much everything and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.